It's estimated that only 5% of homeless in Bannock County are youth, but one organization is still trying to get them back on their feet. KPVI News That Works For You reporter Andre Phillips has the story. He joins us now live from the newsroom with more. Andre. Thanks, guys. Homelessness is a reality for many young people. Today I spoke with a local organization that's created a safe haven for many runaways and drop-ins for over 40 years. Homeless youth is more prevalent and it's in our high schools. It's kids you know that um, you might not even know because they're couch surfing or um, hanging at friends' houses. It looks like any other regular house in Pocatello's old town. But Bannock House is different. It's a safe haven not only for homeless youth, but for transitioning young adults who have nowhere else to go. Now, how many beds does Bannock Youth Center hold? Uh, here at Bannock House, we have 14 beds. Mm -hmm and those are for males and females, ages 10 to 18. Creating happiness is all a part of Leslie Foltz's role as the social services supervisor. But she says the hardest part of her job is watching kids struggle. They should be having their needs met by adults and them not having adults that can do that for them mm -hmm. and trying to teach them those skills to have to make it on their own. Foltz says the young people who qualify to live here are usually kicked out of their homes or either runaways who range from 10 all the way up to 18 years old. So because of the trauma they have had in life, of course, there's some mental health and some needs they have in that way. I feel like our community has a lot of good resources for youth that, um, you know, for medications, counseling, and the services they need, and we do connect them with those services. One young man we met didn't want to be identified on camera, but says Bannock House helped him at a low point in his life. You know, my mother, my relationship with my mother got really uh, hard, and uh, I found myself uh, for the past six months uh, sleeping from couch to couch or, or you know, staying with people I really didn't know. They really kind of turned my life around and uh, helped me a lot to get back on the right track. So I really thank them for that because that's something that I really um, needed at the time and they were really there for me. Now Bannock House is part of the Bannock Youth Foundation with ha which has an array of programs from counseling to supportive services. If you'd like to learn more about them, visit byfhome.com.